guys welcome back to another video on the channel so today I'll be teaching you how to activate DJ's dynamic dasher so if you want to activate DJ's dynamic dasher you first have to activate Sabrina cyber shredder and Russo's robot resonator I have two other videos on that so make sure to go check those out if you want to activate the dynamic dasher or you will not be able to do this okay so um yeah once you watch those videos, uh, you're gonna have Sabrina Cyber Shredder because you need the Cyber Shredder to do this, so it has to be activated. So yeah, when once you have that, you want to go over here, okay? There are there are boards around two doors, so they're over here actually. You guys see this uh, champion shop? It's beside. Uh, it's on to the left of it. Uh, you see, guys. You see that these boarded doors. Someone just went through it. And if you want to go through it, you need the cyber shredder. As you guys can see, it is a mythical axe, so that it could basically break down these uh wooden doors. So if you want to do that, you want to equip it and then break it. It breaks it, as you guys can see, it does that animation. And you want to go over here next. And then you want to break this door. There are three doors. And now you want to do some uh, RB, uh, you want to do some RB battles parkour. And you want to get there. You want to get to up there. So, like, you just want to, okay, it's actually kind of hard, but, you know, you just got to make it up there. Like, okay, we made it up here. Now you want to uh, break this now and over here you will put place the dasher so you're gonna get the um dynamic dasher i already have it activated but yeah you could place it i want to see if i could still place it no i cannot place it but i'm just gonna unequip it unequip both of them so yeah you need to play so you want to go down again you want to go back down and you want to go over here. So as you guys can see, you could play a code. You need to play a code for the drums, which will activate the, uh, get not the guitar, the uh, dynamic dasher. So this is the, these are the other drums. As you guys can see, that was the other drum. You need to play something called a paradoodle. I'm not sure what that is, but uh, Creekcraft found that out like a few, like two days ago. You need to play something called a paradoodle to activate this. It's some uh, type of, I don't know, dynamic dasher language. I don't know. So you could do this with two people, like one person's there and one person's here. It would be easier like that, but you could do it with one person, which you could do as well, which I did. So yeah, we're gonna do the code. But but to do the code, you don't you don't want to start over here. You want to start all the way over. This is the code. Okay, you wanna play this drum once. You wanna hit it once. Now you wanna quickly go over here. You wanna quickly go over here and you wanna play this one once. And then you wanna go back over here. Real quick, um. Okay, okay, alright. We're here now. You wanna play this one uh, twice. Now when we do that, we're gonna go back here, we're gonna go back there again, and uh, one, once we're here, we want to play this one once, and when we're there, we want to go back here again, it's, it's pretty complicated, but you can do it, you want to play this one once, and once we play that once, we want to go back again. this one twice and this should activate the dynamic dasher so yeah guys uh, I already activated it so it won't show up for me but this should work for you so yeah guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to like and subscribe turn on notifications so you never miss an upload and also before I end this video uh, you gotta pick up the dynamic dasher from that wooden door uh, as you guys remember this one you gotta uh, get it from so yeah, now let's do the outro. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Turn on post notifications.
should say never.